Hello everybody, this is Daryl the Auto Cool Guy and today we're going to take a look at the new AC pressure controller. I had a lot of emails out of Saudi Arabia and that desert area about uh, being able to control the AC pressure and of course it gets like to 120 in the shade in those areas so anyway we uh, finally figured out that we can use a Schrader valve on the high side of the compressor and then with a pressure sensor we can uh, do some magic. In this controller the pressure sensor is connected to the DC here input and the ground okay and on the power it goes to the this connects to the battery this connects to the ignition and this is ground like you on your controller now this pin here is the output that's going to go to either your your fail safe pin or your AC pin this is the program plug that you use to either go use in a in the fail safe mode or the or the air, air AC mode so <clears throat> if you put the connector between the common and the AC with this connector you're going to be in the AC mode to where that'll switch to plus 12 volts if you connect this connector between the common and the fail safe here in the fail safe mode that's going to go to ground now below this connector is a three pin connector as you see this is a two pin so that's how they program that so let's turn the system on uh, take a look at some LEDs and boy those LEDs are bright aren't they Ooh. okay let's put some tape over that to help, help cut the uh, blur there you go okay so we have 10 LEDs that go basically from 0 to 100 percent with no uh, pressure you're going to have this one LED lit up so this this control this potentiometer is our uh, simulates our pressure sensor so we can go from like zero to hundred percent and so on and the knob you see here is going to be the trip level where you want the system to be turned the fan to be turned on either in the AC mode or the the fan mode or, yeah the AC or the or the failsafe mode so if we set that about mid scale on pressure we set this at, at half 50 percent point that should be about 50 psi so if you have a 200 psi sensor full scale that's going to be 200 psi so this would be 100 psi if you set the dial at midpoint it should trip at about 50 psi to turn your fan on in the fail safe mode or in the fan mode and this is so we supply this with a 10 inch hose with a schrader valve if you need longer or shorter hoses let me know I can accommodate your uh, request I need to uh, figure this out for uh, for this market the um, controller has a basically a long cooldown timer so it's going to work with your controller in the cooldown mode so there you have it kiddos this is what the sensor looks like anyway so you can get if you want you can get 300 psi sensors or or whatever 100 psi depending so like i say this this will show the output of the sensor is like zero to five well zero to four and a half volts with five volts in so if you go below it's going to switch the blue led off here Oop. and so on so there you have there you have it kiddos so it's a, it should be on the market pretty quick and on the website. Thanks for watching, guys. Talk to you later.